Alright, how you guys doing? It's your boy One coming at you once again. As you can see here, I finally completed my custom Friday the 13th Part 7 New Blood Jason figure. Um, took me about a week or two, maybe more. Uh, I won't say that. I didn't work on it straight. Uh, i actually been done with the figure. Uh, I was working on the uh, accessories and uh, you know I mean just doing some touch-ups had a little bit of a hard time with the hockey mask but I finally got it um, so just want to show you guys what I did here uh, all this is hand sculpted and painted by me uh, was originally a WWE figure not really sure who um, it's a real metal chain uh, as you can see I got the uh, rib cage and bones protruding and clothes all tattered um, also it's fine it's pretty accurate I, I try to get as accurate as I possibly can I can't do 100% but you know it's pretty good um, yeah so uh, I got the uh, bones and the kneecap and the, the boots all hands go by you you know what I'm saying I did that um, anyway okay took me a while uh, it, it has a lot of uh, articulation a lot more than uh, you know, those of you who've seen my reviews on the other figures, uh, has a little bit more than that. You know, of course, the arms do come out still, you know what I mean? And they also had the swivel on the arm right here. You don't really see that with the Jason figures. Uh, still got the 360 wrist movement, you know what I mean, in both hands. And I included, uh, you know, the knee joints. Oh, tell me, have you ever seen a Jason figure do that? All right, that's what I'm talking about, guys. Ooh. It did lose its waist movement, um, cause, uh, you know, just the skin was coming out too far, so I had to add more of the pants, so it didn't have the, it doesn't have the waist movement, it did take that away, the, the head turns, you know what I mean, I don't like to turn it too much, but, um, and of course, the hockey mask is removable, goes on and off real easy, if, you can't really tell, but you can see the eye in there, so it's right where it needs to be, um, there you go, there's the face guys, it's pretty accurate, uh, real close, you know what I mean, you can feel free to move the head, it's not going to mess up on you, you know what I mean, it's really tight, there you go, I don't the camera doesn't pick it up that great, but, you know what I mean, it's really good, very proud of it, um, I wish you could see the eye and the pupil, I mean, the color, it's, it's on point guys, um, yeah, you got the skull, you know, showing. I got the teeth right here. You can't really tell, but, you know what I mean? You can probably see them better in the photos. Of course, I got the axe. Custom made the axe myself. So it's pretty solid. It ain't gonna break on you. Um, the machete is just from a part six or uh, maybe a remake, so, you know what I mean? Whatever. Goes in there. I had to drill a hole in this hand because for some reason a lot of these WWE figures. <laughs> are left handed but um you know what I mean okay. and I also have this uh branch trimmer we I don't really know got the pull string right here uh that's the gas tank uh the original in the movie it didn't include this side handle but I, I put it on there it's just easier for it to for him to hold so you know what I mean I got this and he holds this up right here it goes on real easy See the bloody blade it turns, you know what I mean? It doesn't turn great, but it does turn pretty well. You know what I mean, so mm -hmm. Let's put the mask back on. Let's get the mask on. There you go. So yeah, your boy was hard at work, uh very happy with it. Uh they will get even better and better. I, I intend on doing a few more as you can see back here. Yes guys, I am doing the Jason Taste Manhattan figure. I've got a lot of work to do. This is real rough. Um, also working on the uh, Alice from Resident Evil uh, Extinction. Not one of my favorite movies. It was okay though. I mean, got a lot of work to do on her. Um, I still got the Uber Jason in the background, the 12 inch. A lot of work. I, I took a break on it because it's frustrating, but uh, I'm gonna go full force on that soon. And I've got a few of these little guys right here. I have uh, plans on doing a custom predator figure, removable helmet, and do all that. I got a lot of stuff in the works, guys. So, you know what I mean? Stay tuned and uh, 
Oh yeah, by the way, this guy will be available on eBay. Thank you.